as we celebrate our heritage. Morristown celebrated the past and the future at the official opening of its new heritage park. The 52 acre park sits where Morristown College once stood. The historically black college closed down in 1994. 10 News reporter Sean Franklin shows us how the city plans to keep those memories alive. Hey, girl, how you doing? Life's road has many twists and turns. It is very dear to me. But Morris Sherrill's <laughs> All right, Cliff. always knows where home is. Put my life on the right road. Home is where his friends are. Right, you see old Mike Graham? He was up there. And where Morristown College used to be. We still have those memories. And um, we look back and see how valuable the school was. Morristown City officials, alumni, and supporters cut the ribbon for the Salute to Heritage Park Saturday. As we celebrate our heritage. The 52-acre park will stand as a place to enjoy the future and remember the past with recreational space and historical markers. Markers will remember the one of only two higher educational institutions for African Americans in East Tennessee before the Civil Rights Movement. It closed in 1994. There's so many good things that uh, this park is helping to uh, solve and, and create. Morristown Mayor Gary Chesney says the city bought the land after the college's buildings became unusable. In a neighborhood that we're looking to revitalize, uh, a neighborhood that used to be the heartbeat of residential living in Morristown. Now there's a new heartbeat where the old college used to stand. I hope that uh, they're able to build a um, some type of building that they can come back and recap those memories. In Morristown, Sean Franklin, 10 News.